globally, I don't post. Usually, I don't post, but I want the world to know. Time to pull a drop top. Thank you. Out. Summer nights. We are down to raining season, you know. I don't know what's going on, but the weather is cloudy. It's drizzling on me right now. And I want to step out to just make my hair. I kind of put up a ponytail up there. And I intend wearing a wig, maybe for a while. I just feel like, you know, playing around with my wigs. I'm always packing them up. And I don't feel like doing that again, okay? Come with me, let's just step out and have some fun today. It's going to be an amazing vlog as usual, okay? Usually, I don't post. I'm done making the hair and this is what it's looking like. I could not even show you guys. This hair took me like 20, 30 minutes and we're done. Can you see? It looks so fine. I, I, I can't remember last time I had a good corn roll that looks so neat and so fine like this. So it looks so fresh. See baby Jenna, she has carried biscuits and scattered it. Jenna? Jenna has carried biscuits and scattered my whole car. Give me. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. High five. High five, mm. High five. You got one. Alright, let's go. There's a million of those who won't let us see But they're not gonna, not gonna see me bleed Cause baby, I got you, 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 you I've been beating to the ground as a cross the dust I've been scared to live to some people never learn But they're not gonna, not gonna watch me burn Cause baby, I got you, 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 you It's a new beginning to the bed literally put chicken I want to make because I want to make coconut spag and I brought it out to the froze not even knowing that this thing has been like there's literally no water I didn't even know that the sink is open I closed it myself I turned on hot water and I was hoping this thing was actually defrozen all my mind is let me come and spice it up and marinate it and keep and you guys just imagine this is frozen this is literally frozen <laughs> and I'm hungry. It's actually closed. So why did the water slip away? I've not had anything all day. This is almost three o'clock. 
I'm very very much hungry and this is still frozen you guys this is frozen I'm so angry I'm so pissed off right now I don't know where I want to start from but it's frustrating because I want to film a video I've been slowly dragging my leg today to film this video but I really want to film this video because I really need to upload it tomorrow and just imagine the chicken I've been trying to defrost is still it's still frozen I'm <laughs> Anyways, what is going on? How you are doing? Hi. See, let me just clean up my hand because it's a mess right now, okay? Hi guys, what is going on? So, I want to make coconut um, spag. I've been thinking of what to make and I didn't. I don't want to eat rice. I made fried rice yesterday, so I definitely don't want to eat rice today, okay? And tomorrow, I don't want to make rice either. And um, let me show you guys this shallot I made at home because I'm out of onion. I'm supposed to go get onion, okay? But there was a time onion was becoming very, very expensive, like extremely expensive. So when I used to go to Oimi back then, let me bring it up. Use my air fryer because as I'm out of onion right now, this is what I use, okay? This, you just put it inside your pot and it comes back to life. That's just the basic truth about it. Once you put this inside the pot, it's like... You're using an onion because it's just dehydrated i use my air fryer to dehydrate this so I, I was my main goal was to fill up this whole thing with onions like dehydrated one these ones are the ones are when i did the first one here got filled up i needed something bigger so i started using this one but ever since then i haven't gone to the market again so i stopped along the line and jenna and I was thinking of what would I use right now that I need onion and I just remembered because I used this yesterday to cook and it didn't feel like there was no onion in my food so if you have an air fryer or a dehydrator you could actually dehydrate your shell your onions and just save them up as shallots use them anytime right now there's nobody to run around for me so I would use this to make what I want to make because once it goes back inside the pot it comes back alive and you still get that exact onion flavor and taste that you want in your meal so trust me if you're a mom or probably this is a must have in your house okay this saves you a lot of stress so this is what i'll be using to cook i just wanted to show you guys another way i save my resources i have just for rainy days is like this that nobody actually goes out to help me get stuffs another thing there's the last one i'll share okay is habanero pepper so i usually would buy pepper like the normal regular fresh pepper thank you i would usually get the normal regular fresh pepper for like 3k for the half custard which is like the tomato container and um there was a time i used to buy the original habanero just 1000 so this time around i got the original habanero half a custard for 6000 which is what is here so this will literally like almost fold this thing and you guys you see my teaspoon you see this spoon i take very if i want to make anything that's to tell you how hot this paper is i don't even take up to half of this teaspoon because it is so hot so i feel like this one saved me more cost because on a norm by now i would have finished the whole of this because this doesn't even last me a month because i love my foods a bit spicy so by now i would have like down this but see what i have here <laughs> it's funny see i still have like a lot that could even last me for another one month because any mistake you should make and you use more than this you guys you're gonna cry it's not like um it's not choking the smell is not choking but you still get that very nice scent from it. it's like original habanero if you go to the market not everybody sells it but if you see where they sell it is quite expensive so i close my eyes i close my ear and i bought it and it has been doing me good because right now this paper has lasted and i feel it will even run me for next month unlike before by now i would have gone to get another one I would have gone to get another one. Jenna likes the kitchen. That's one thing I've noticed. I can't just hide away. Or maybe because I'm the only one around. So she tends to follow me all the time. But anyways, let me just carry you guys along. and start spicing up what I want to use to cook. And show you guys today. Uh, I just want to make coconut spag. I'm quite hungry. I've not filmed and all of that. Okay? Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom taught me that. I figured why we fool around. So little. And we keep track of time Being so serious Idiots Thinking it will 
matter, keep me company downtown Before the clock runs out Sun is shining, but the rain is welcome too Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind, but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around And then I remember All things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up so I've been able to marinate the chicken, which I am looking at right now. Okay, I just whooped up everything and just, you know, allow it to marinate for a while. Uh, I still have a little bit of patience, so I can allow it to marinate for a while. Then I want to spoil my thing. There's a problem I have. I don't know why she's always in the kitchen. When it's time for her to come and do the normal... Um, it's crying because I collected the thing from her. So when it's time for her to come and do normal duties of a woman in the kitchen, she will start complaining. Anyways, this is what I have left from my banana bread I made yesterday. I think I showed you guys when I made the banana bread. So it's almost out. Yesterday's own was uh, a bit bigger. The quantity is a bit bigger compared to the normal one. So this is what it's looking like. Let me show you guys. You can see some banana on it. So I put it in the refrigerator and just allowed it to like, you know, stay there till this morning because I don't know if it will go back. I don't know if it will go bad by morning, but guys, can you see that goodness? It really came out well. Also, some play, some parts I added toppings, some parts I didn't add toppings. So this is the part that has the toppings, which of um, the toppings is the banana I used, and it's so nice. It feels like I'm lying every time Someone asks how it goes And I save the details that actually mean something mm -hmm. Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind, but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around And then I remember all things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up I finished eating like a long time ago I want to like make a little smoothie just this night for Hobby and I because oh, That food was a lot I kid you know, the food was a lot Jenna is coming I was seeing one Indian Indian movie you guys this movie is called Maharaj and the movie is so funny because I don't know what kind of God sleeps with people that they are meant to get married to like you sleep with the young girls of a community my battery is down let me change it the movie the man is meant to be like a king the gatekeeper to their god and then they have this traditional ritual that they only do and, and at the end of the ritual they will pick someone they call it chava chava savant something like that at the end of the ritual the man will pick a lady and do you know what the lady will do the lady will sleep with this man she's sleeping with the man to get fortune she was choosing mind you the man is married the man has a wife the man has a daughter and she was sleeping with this man and every other politicians or every other top ruler will be watching from the window watch how she sleeps with the man and all of that and they say that the their god have chosen the person so her fiance that is supposed to get married to her was like where is she after the whole ritual and everything and they said oh she was choosing and the fiance was going to like see choosing because he's not from that part of the community he's from a different community and just moved to that place and grew up there so when he went up to look at the fiance he saw that the fiance was sleeping with the man and the fiance is this kind of person that is always writing out news about oh they should abolish some certain laws like the widows wearing white for years they don't rub them colors even when they are doing those their ritual like you see them spraying different colors the widows don't tend to attend and then they always cast people out that and they should abolish all of those laws that they are not necessary so when the man went up there and saw the fiance and he was like what that uh, he sent the fiance to school for four years she should know better 
that this is not right like you sleeping with a man that is not your husband and you say it's a ritual and everybody's watching you naked sleeping with a man through the window that what kind of tradition is that she said that it's giving her divine favor and all of that and me watching that movie i'm like are you are you kidding me like right now like what is this even if you don't know left from right you literally know that it is wrong people are watching you from all different places and you're performing this ritual and then you still go ahead to still marry the husband and this is something that all the men there literally their wife would do if they are choosing and then they still get to like sleep with the wife and marry the wife and nothing happened i guess well everybody watching you one like is a kind of a, a a porn movie where people are watching you having sex with your king and the guy had to challenge the king and said that you know what he's not marrying again told the girl let's leave this place the girl said no that the guy should go he'll come back she'll come by herself and the guy was like i'm done i'm not getting married to you again this engagement is over because they were engaged and about to get married that very month a few months after so when they asked the guy why did he leave he said that he cannot marry the girl that the girl has you know sold herself out uncles of the guy were like what do you mean that you're disgracing the girl that the girl has been favored by the god and all of that you guys i'll put the title of the movie somewhere on the screen for you guys to go see the girl had to commit suicide you know what guys i'll continue this just let our own so let's, let's let's continue this vlog so this is my i just topped it up with some biscuits right here and then i have some greek yogurt you guys already know this greek yogurt i got and this is so nice this is actually a very nice combo this is amazing